Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Stacy. I was trying to figure out what kind of video I want to do, trying to slowly work my way back into filming for this channel. And I thought it might be fun to do kind of a throwback kind of video. Something I used to do in the very beginning uh, when I first started filming was doing concealed carry outfits of the day. And I did a couple where I did um, what I wore throughout the week. So I think I'm gonna attempt to do that with this one. <laughs> so I'm getting ready to go run some errands with my daughter. We're gonna go hit the thrift stores. I love thrift store shopping. It is like treasure hunting for me. Uh, so I'm gonna be trying on some clothes today while I'm out. And I wanted to be able to pretty much conceal in anything that I try on today. Could be dresses, skirts, pants, um, jeans, or pants with elastic in it. So I needed something that worked with all the outfits plus I wanted to try something that I used to love ever so much back in the day and I haven't worn it in forever I wanted to see how it's working out for me now so here is what I'm wearing today I'm just wearing this kind of loose fitted stripey t-shirt it's red and white stripes I don't know if you can tell that and I have on just a pair of jeans I think these are from Madewell but I got these at the thrift store so for a great price and underneath I am wearing my Undertech Undercover Concealment Shorts. These are amazing. These are compression shorts, so like sporty type shorts. I have my Sig P238 on and I have it in a Vetter Kydex holster with an ulti clip that I have attached into the pocket of the shorts. So this setup is quite safe. It is very snug. It is not going to move around. I could go run on the treadmill, do jumping jacks, all the things, try on all the clothes, and they are very comfortable and very safe. So it also conceals very well, although my gun is pretty tiny. Um, I don't have to worry about that. This is what the shorts look like not on, so you can get a better idea of what I'm wearing. I always add the Kydex holster to these shorts just to, you know, give you that extra layer of safetiness and protection. Nothing is going to get the trigger. It's locked in place. Um, so I don't have any issues at all with wearing these shorts. I think they're pretty awesome and I'm pretty sure they do still sell them. I will go to the website and link these if I can find it. Uh, it's been a while. <laughs> Anyway, guys, that is my outfit for today, and I will check in with y'all tomorrow. Hey, guys, welcome back to day two of me getting fully dressed and ready for the day. Yesterday was gorgeous. It was almost 80 degrees, and the sun was shining. It was the most beautiful day. Today, it's very dreary. It's drizzly. It's gross, and it's cold. Um, so I wanted to dress warm and be cozy. I might run out to the grocery store later today if I can muster up enough energy to go out in the drizzle. <laughs> I hate the rain. I hate it so much. Uh, it makes me just want to hibernate. And because I am dressed super cozy today, that makes carrying very easy. So I just have on this white t-shirt. I don't know where it's from. It's just a basic white t-shirt. I have this pink cardigan that I think came from Target, but I got it at the thrift store, <laughs> um, but it is a Target brand. Uh, I have on some darker wash jeans today and I'm wearing my Doc Martin uh, leather belt that I got over 20 years ago. So I don't even know if you could find this today, but it is very um, heavy and sturdy and great as a gun belt. And as for concealing, I am wearing this holster today on the waistband. This is a craft uh, leather holster. If I can find this exact one, I will link it down below. They sent this to me a few years ago and I honestly don't wear it that often because I just don't like wearing belts. I don't wear belts very much. When I do wear a belt and I wanna wear it on the outside just because I can, <laughs> I can easily cover this up. Um, this is the holster that I go for. It is very easy to throw on. You just loop it through your, your belt. Um, it is a very thick, sturdy leather. It stays open when you draw, so it is easy to uh, reholster. So I actually love wearing this uh, when I can get away with it. Obviously, I can't wear this if I were just wearing this white t-shirt. This 
would not cover it. <laughs> but it absolutely works like a charm when I am wearing a sweater like this. Also with a sweatshirt or a coat, anything like that, this would work very well with. This might be one of my favorite concealed carry outfits just for its coziness level. All right, guys, that is all I've got for you today. I will check in with y'all tomorrow. Hey y'all, it is day three of filming outfits. Um, the weather is better today. It's not raining. It's still a little chilly though. Definitely chilly enough to wear a sweatshirt. Uh, so that's what I'm wearing today. Uh, I'm gonna run all of my errands that I did not run yesterday because I did not leave the house. I have to return some stuff at the library. I have to go to the grocery store and I have to pick up bird food. All of my bird feeders are empty, so I have to replace that. So that's what I'm gonna be doing today. I'm also gonna be uh, cleaning out my car. We are gonna be going to the Tennessee property tomorrow. We were supposed to go later in the week, um, but schedules have changed. So now we can go a few days early. So I need to clean my car. Um, I do not like being in a gross car for a long car trip. So, all right, pretty basic. Uh, this is me in a nutshell. Uh, if you are looking for fancy dress up clothes on my channel, you're probably not gonna find much of that here. I typically live in jeans, preferably comfy ones with elastic. These have elastic and um, t-shirts, sweatshirts, whatever. I am a very, comfy cozy type of person and with these I am wearing my comfort concealment band so it just looks like this it's not a very thick uh, belly band it's just a thin belt kind of size and I have my Vetter holster clipped to this band with an ulti clip so it looks like that and so it's nice and safe and secure. This band does a really good job of kind of sticking to your skin so it doesn't like move around or bounce up and down very easily at all. Um, I feel like it's very secure. I love that it's adjustable. It's just Velcro right here. So you can make it as tight or as loose as you want. I love that you can use whatever um, Kydex holsters you have with this so you can wear this with multiple guns as long as you have a, a holster for your gun you can switch it up very easily it's simple to throw on i believe this band costs between 30 to 40 dollars so it's a great price point for something like this i think it is just a great staple to have for anyone who conceals carry uh so yeah that is how it looks on my shirt down you would have no clue but i have got my sig in here. So yeah, that is all I got for today and I will see you tomorrow. All right guys, this is day four of concealed carry outfits. Uh, I'm actually in Tennessee right now. I'm at our property. This is part of it. I will do a more in-depth property tour while I'm out here. Um, some of you guys said you were interested in that. But for today, I do have some errands I have to run feels like that is what I do every day. Uh, but every time we come out here, I try to do a little bit to this house to make it more livable and cuter because it really is a hot mess. So I'm running out today and I'm heading several stores. The weather is gorgeous. It's about 70 degrees and sunny and beautiful. So here is what I'm wearing today. I have on this um, t-shirt that is from Target. It's just their plain t-shirt. It's blue, whatever pair of jeans, just um, regular waisted jeans. And I'm wearing my SIG up further on my belly today because there wasn't a whole lot of room down here. And when I had it lower, it kind of looked like I had a bulge, which I don't want to look like I have. So I pushed it up further today. And so this is how it looks with it up here. You can hear me hitting it. Again, I just have it in my Vetter holster with the Ulti clip attached to the Comfort Concealment band. And I just made the band tighter with the Velcro and pushed it further up. And there you go. All right, guys, that is all I've got for this video. I'm gonna go ahead and stop um, with the outfits here because I don't want it to be too long. Let me know if you like this sort of video. Um, again, I just wanted to do it because it was a throwback to how I kind of started my channel. I do have two new holsters that are actually being delivered to my house in Virginia today. And I'm not gonna be home for at least a week, so I'm not gonna get to try those out for a while. 
Anyway, guys, I hope you all are having a great day and I will see y'all soon. Bye.